Hello, boys and girls. Today we're going to read a book with Dan the Story Man called The Nuffle Bunny. And hey, since we're reading The Nuffle Bunny, I thought I'd get my bunny on and have fun with you together. So let's have fun reading this book. And is it, it is a cautionary tale by Mo Williams. All right, let's read this book. Love Mo Williams. Here we go. Nuffle Bunny. Oh, look, I want to show you. There is... Trixie, there's Trixie's mom and dad getting married and then having her. There she is, a little baby. And there they are. No, uh, Trixie's getting older and she's in a little carrier her dad has on her. And there she is, holding her Nuffle Bunny. Let's see what happens to Nuffle Bunny. Not so long ago, before she could even speak words, Trixie went on an errand with her daddy. Ooh, there's little Trixie. Whoa. There's little Trixie there. And she is going. What do you think she's doing with her daddy? What do you think? That's right. They're doing laundry. They're cleaning clothes. And look, Trixie has her little bunny with her. Her little Nuffle bunny. Trixie and her daddy went down the block. Through the park. There they are. There's Trixie and her daddy walking down the block. Daddy's holding laundry and Trixie's holding Nuffle Bunny. And then they go through the park, walking through the park. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Going to the laundromat. Going to clean clothes. Past the school and into the laundromat. There they go. Past the school. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And into the laundromat to clean clothes. There they go, together. Trixie helped her daddy put the laundry into the machine. Oh, let's see how much Trixie's helping. There's Trixie, is she helping? Is she helping her daddy? I don't know how much she's helping. Looks like she has a pair of pants on her head and she has a sock in her hand and some kind of other thing in her other hand. And, uh-oh, what's, in the, what's in, the, in, the, in the laundry basket? What's in the clothes basket? Is that Nuffle Bunny? Uh oh, her dad's going to grab Nuffle Bunny. What's going to happen to Nuffle Bunny? <gasps> oh no. She even got to put the money in the machine. Oh, she's a good helper. Then they left. You got to tell me what you see. Here we go. There's Trixie helping her daddy put the, put the money in the machine. <gasps> what do you see in the machine? What's in there? Look close. <gasps> there they are. What's in the machine? What do you see looking at the out the window? Is that Nuffle <gasps> But a block or so later, Trixie realized something. There they are walking down the block. And there's Trixie. What did what did she remember? What did she miss? Trixie turned to her daddy and said, Aggle flabble glabble. That's right, replied her daddy. We're going home. Is that what Trixie said? Did Trixie say, we're going home? Or did she say something else? Hmm. Aggle flabble glabble, said Tag Trixie again. Blackle plabble, wobbly flabbly, snurp. <laughs> there she is, trying to tell her daddy something. But her daddy didn't understand what she was saying. What is she saying? Hmm, her daddy's like, oh, no. Now, please, don't get fussy, said her daddy. Well, she had no choice. Trixie bawled. <laughs> she went boneless. <laughs> Look at her. Look at her. And she's like, oh, she's trying to tell her daddy something. Does her, is her daddy listening? Is her daddy? Oh, what's going on with my ears? Sorry. <laughs> oh, let's try this again. <laughs> she's trying to tell her daddy something, but her daddy's just not getting it. 
She did everything she could to show how unhappy she was. By the time they got home, her daddy was unhappy too. There they are, walking through the park, going crazy. There she is crying her head off. And when they got home, daddy wasn't happy. Trixie wasn't happy. As soon as Trixie's mommy opened the door, she asked, Where's Nuffle Bunny? Ugh, mommies are so smart. Mommies, they just know what's going on. And Trixie's like, Yeah, where's Nuffle Bunny, Daddy? Where's Nuffle Bunny? Uh oh. The whole family ran down the block and through the park. There they are, running down the block. Here they are, running in the park. They zoom past the school, almost went into an old lady, and into the laundromat. There they go, past the school, into the laundromat, and into the laundromat. There they go, running, running, running. Gotta find Nuffle Bunny. Trixie's daddy looked for Nuffle Bunny, and looked, and looked, and looked. But Nuffle Bunny was nowhere to be found. I'm so sad. It's okay. I hope we find him. There's Daddy looking, reaching in, looking over, looking under. Can't find Nuffle Bunny. No. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. Excuse me. So Trixie's daddy decided to look harder. Go, Daddy, go! Until, until... <laughs> Nubble Bunny! Yay! <laughs> daddy found Nubble Bunny. Way to go, Daddy. Yeah, yeah. And Trixie said Nubble Bunny. <laughs> and those were the first words Trixie ever said. Oh, there's Trixie, so happy, hugging her Nuffle Bunny, yeah! So cute, so adorable. Thank you so much for reading The Nuffle Bunny with me by Mo Williams. And thank you for joining me, Dan. I know you didn't know it was me, but I am Dan, the story man, not Dan the Bunny Man. <laughs> hey, if you have any books that you'd like to read, please tell your parent, grandparent, teacher, and tell them to tell me. And I will try to read them for you. So until next time, don't lose your bunny and have a great day. Enjoy your day. Ta-ta and toodaloo for now.